Hello everyone and welcome back to Skyrim Survival Mode. I've looted just around the camp quickly and Janessa now has a new helmet and I noticed that I have a perk point to spend and I've decided I'm going to use it on Deadly Aim. So sneak attack with bows are now better. Now we've got a bandit leader to kill and this could go absolutely horribly. Now I don't know if it's just him. If it's just him, this will be nice and simple. If it's more than just him, this will be a problem. Okay, he's down there. And he's coming up now. It's just him. And, oh, Janessa! That's not the time to be sneaking. Alright, well, Janessa's got involved already. Let's just see if we can pummel into him. And, yeah, I gave Janessa that staff just because... I want to sell it, but it's dealing some real damage. It's not bad. Okay, come on, come on, come on. I don't know if these are actually hitting. Is he being hurt? I hope he's being hurt. Yeah, those arrows are totally hitting him. Cool, this is actually going to be a bit of an easier fight than I imagined. Oh, and I get the final kill. Look at that, and he does a backflip. Very impressive. Sweet, that was actually incredibly easy. That's quite nice. Well, now I just get to loot everything. And, ooh, nice elven shield of magic suppression. Alrighty, I have just spent literally five minutes mining, and this now means I can make a whole bunch of auric alchem ingots. Although I'm one all short, which is slightly annoying. However, I can give those all to Janessa, and then I have tons of crafting supplies if I ever need them. I've just taken a good night's sleep and throw some into Magicka because, yeah, I'm a bit, uh, I was fairly tired. Yep, and now that's all gone. Uh, I'm, st oh, I'm still drained. I slept for six hours and I'm still not in full condition. However, now what we shall be doing is, are you on the quests? Return to Sid Gear. And, yep, we just need to do these things. Return a whole bunch of stuff because I don't think we've got anything else specifically for Folk Reef. I'm pretty sure these are all other stuff, which we don't need to worry about. So, now we have quite a long journey on our way. And depending on what happens, we may just teleport forwards in the edit. Ooh. I can't recall if this broken tower thing is dangerous or not. Ah, uh, yep, I'm totally checking this out. Oh, oh, it's a wolf. Oh, well, that's easy. And we get the kill cam. Yep, we're going down. And, oh, there's the other wolf. Oi! Back! Bad wolf! Bad wolf! Bad wolf. Alright, I didn't get a disease from that, did I? I actually need to be half careful for... Nope, no disease. Sweet. And now i just got a wolf to loot. Oh, I'm starting to get peckish, though. You don't get wolf meat. Wolf meat would have been a nice addition. Mm. Don't really get that though, which is somewhat annoying. And all right, there's a chest here with a bit of gold. Oh yeah, you know what? That stuff's not too bad. Nothing amazing, but won't complain. And hi, Janessa. Yeah. About time you showed up. Did I go to this place before? I think I hear a zombie near me. Ah. Yeah, we got a necromancer to deal with. It shouldn't be too tough, though. Um, out of the way, random imperial. Um, who are you? Take this and hold on to it. Oh, steel armor of minor illusion. Um, Janessa, we're gonna kill this guy, okay? Thank you. Or maybe not. Oi, 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 can you kill him for me, please, Janessa? Because he seems to be running away. He's not fighting, which is actually rather annoying. Come on, just kill this fugitive. Oh, hurry up. Okay, let's take this poison and start looting this random necromancer place. Yeah, you, yielding doesn't matter. And Janessa, get back over here. I need to dump this steel armor on you. It's weighing me down and just draining all my stamina. 
Oi! No! <laughs> I just killed that deer in one shot! What was it even doing? I... Don't turn me around whilst... Oh, I don't want to... Yeah, he's over there. We're literally killing him right now. Alright, I'm keeping the steel armor, of course, because, I mean, why would I give it away? This fugitive doesn't put up much of a fight. Oh, come on. This is so painfully slow. Okay. No, come on. If you cannot best us, why aren't you dying? Good job. Now, Janessa, over here. I want to loot that dead guy and give you... Oh, my God. This is so painfully slow. All right, let's just loot him, and then we can deal with handing Janessa a whole bunch of stuff. And, oh, wow, he's got nothing good on him. Do you even have a carry capacity for this armor? what you wish. You do not. Um, Let's go. that's annoying. I should have probably just given it to the guy then. Hey. Where's... I'm still over carry capacity. Alright, you need to take a whole bunch more of my stuff. Hey, mister, I've got your steel armor here. Do you want to take it? Yes. Um, this. Yeah. It's yours. Look. Are you seriously not going to take that? How far away are we from Falk Reef? We're... We're not that far. Alright. We're taking this back with us. It's not going to be the easiest thing to do. But I'm literally just going to hold it like this. And whenever I want to pick something, I have to drop it and then pick it back up. This could take a while. Oh, and I can't sprint either because then I just run into it. Alright. This is somewhat annoying. Hold on a second. What? Will do. Um. Alright, I just remembered you can order your follower to pick it up. However, I dropped it right here. I asked her to pick it up. And now she just seems to be wandering away from me. Did you actually... We might have just lost that steel armor forever. Um... Yep, we've lost it forever. No idea what happened to that. Well, that's rather annoying. What's even worse is we were just round the corner from Falk Reef. So I just lost a whole bunch of gold thanks to the game doing something stupid. Which is quite irritating. Alright, first stop. Let's go talk to the Jarl. Tell him we killed that bandit leader. What's up, Sid Gear? See you. Teach them to stop paying me. Here, you deserve a reward for your service. You know what? I like you. You're not hey. I hereby grant you permission to purchase property in Falk Reef Hold. Talk to my steward if you're interested. Purchase property, you say? I'm also gonna ask if there's anything there's else he needs. In my court for a new fame. It's an honorary title mainly. But there are a few perks someone like you could make use of. However, I could only grant the title to someone who is known throughout my hold. You help my people, and I'll make you my fame. On your way, then. And yep, we have a chance to help the people of Fork Reef and da di da di da However, first off, 6,339 gold. How much does it co- Oh, 5,000. Alright, I'm buying it. Yep. Uh, I I've just spent all my money on just a plot of land. That's- Oh, so much gold gone. Alright, let's turn in this other quest and start assisting the people of Falk Reef a bit more. Out of guess, closer to being Fane. Hey, Runeil, I've got your journal. It's a collection of regrets that I try not to forget. Here, I promised you this. And 750 gold added. So that's not bad. And that's another assisting the people of Falk Reef done. Uh, uh, I'm trying to work out what else I can do. That's going to be nice and easy. 
I'll change your face. Make you look completely All right. Oh, did you need something? Keep a song in your heart. Hello again, friend. Hey, Valdir. All right, so we've helped Valdir and we've helped Runil. Those are probably two of the easiest ones. I thought delivering the ashes counted as well. Maybe not. Seeing as we still need to, you know, do a quest thingy for Falk Reef. Let's talk to... Oh, what's your name? I've forgotten your name. Singding. That's it. He's got a stupid name, hasn't he? Yep, we got a werewolf here. We're just going to chat with him quickly. La -di -da. Oh, wait. Actually... No, 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 no. Do, do I want the ring right Do I want to do this? I'm going to leave this quest for now. I'm going to leave it for now. I've got other stuff I can focus on doing. I also made a whole bunch of potions and sold a few. Just to, you know, get a bit of gold back. Let's visit our house and not become a werewolf. Alright, today let's focus on getting to our house and... Ooh, iron ore vein. If only I actually had a pickaxe. Yeah, let's get to our house, make sure everything's okay there, and see what we can do with it. Because having our house, and this one specifically, between Falk Reef and White Run would be great. So the quicker we can get this built up and improved, the better. And this is going to be a large part of our goal for the series going forwards, is literally just building this house to the best it can be. And it's close to Pine Watch as well, which is nice because they've got a garden there. So, go over the hill and ta-da! My plot of land is right here. I don't know if there's a pickaxe anywhere nearby, which would be my most useful thing though, because there's some ore and stone and other bits and pieces that I'd love to have. Lakeview Manor discovered! A distinct lack of an actual manor here, but the place is discovered regardless. And down there you can see some dead stuff. Yeah, this will be the building site of our home. Home sweet home. Which does not yet yeah, actually exist, but you know. Yeah, something's died over there, but let's not worry about that right now. Let's instead hope that Janessa turns up, because she's got most of my crafting materials. And take a look at what we can do. Because there's the drafting table where we get to, yeah, we need to buy a bunch of stuff. But let's plan a small house. And look, it gets all fenced out and there's actual... F okay, the post. You can walk through the string, but not the post. That's all right. Yeah, but look, we've got it all... F Seriously? All right. Janessa's apparently just been picking fights whilst I've not been paying attention. Cool, let's just... Take all this. Good job, Janessa. Anti-pest control. Oh, there's a little... Oh, free number over here. That's actually quite good. Ah, good work, Janessa. She's... Janessa's starting to grow on me. Obviously, we had our falling out for the first... dozen episodes or so, but now I'm starting to grow a little fond of her. And speaking of which, I need to do a whole bunch of trading with her to get all of my stuff back, but also lower my carry weight just a little. Although, to be honest, yeah, there's no way I'm going to be able to um carry all the stuff I want to. So, oh, she's got 81 gold on her. What's she doing with all that gold? That's my gold. Okay, let's just take everything. And now that I've got everything, I'm actually going to dump it into this chest here. Because one thing I... Oh, I'm not supposed to leave the empty ones. Where am I? One thing I want to do... Du -du 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 -du. Sorry, I'm focusing on not accidentally putting any of my stuff I want away. Yeah, one thing I want to do is hook up the warrior stone. Because there's going to be a lot more smithing and stuff from now on. So the more of this, I've got... There we go. How am I doing on... Yep, I'm fine on carry weight. So let's... yeah, we're very close to the Guardian Stones, so if you'd be kind enough to let me put a... Marker! No, I just want... that'll have to do. Alright, yeah, but... Oh, okay, it's actually shown on the map. No need to worry about a marker, but yeah, we're very close to the Guardian Stones, which is another great thing about this house. It means we've got Riverwood right round the corner. And, ah, oh, sorry, Fox, I saw you in your glitch, so we'll put you out of your misery. Jeez, Janessa, it's a fox. Don't need to be quite so brutal. Alright, we should have at just here. There'll be a necromancer. There should be a necromancer. 
Where's the necromancer gone? I don't know, but let's do a bit of third person archery, which everyone loves, and take down the elk. Oh, look! Oh, wait, it's going too slow, isn't it? It's going to run past. Yep. Stupid kill cams. Let's do a speculative shot. Alright, I don't know quite where the necromancer who's supposed to be here is gone. But whilst he's not here, let's just take a look at this stuff. Because he's got a iron sword, embalming tool, conjuration skill book. Alright, nothing I need to worry about. Let's take the pie thrush egg, though. Oh, there you are! Yeah, I'm going to kill you now. Oh, you're an apprentice conjurer. You're actually fairly tough in which case. Alright, I thought you were just a necromancer. Necromancers are quite easy to deal with. Conjurers are actually quite difficult. Yeah, what she conjured up? Hopefully it's just a familiar. So if it's a familiar, we can kind of deal with that. And she's wasting all of her magicka on a ward. Oh, that is lovely to see. So you want to keep using up your magicka? No, no, no. Oi! Bad! No! No! Not what I... Oh, wait! I can I can use illusion on her, can't I? Yeah, that's actually quite a smart move, me. I totally didn't just hit the wrong keys before. No. Oh, I don't have enough magicka. Cool. Yeah, I'm just going to calm you whilst you're weak. You cool with that? Sweet. Alright, let's carry on with the whole Guardian Stone thing. Oh, Janessa. Oh, Janessa, why are you swimming out there? It's alright, it stopped being summoned anyway. Cool, we've got a Necromancer, or Conjurer even, that lives near us, but I'm sure we'll just learn to deal with that. Back at the Guardian Stones! For the first time in so, so long, and yet the Hanging Moss hasn't respawned. Right, activate the War... Hmm... Yeah, let's activate the Warrior Stone. I also think I'm going to head into Riverwood... And see if I can pick up a pickaxe. Or actually, Bowl Gulch Mine. Bowl Gulch Mine will have a pickaxe in it. And will save me the gold of having to actually buy one. But I'm pretty sure the enemies are still around there. Because I was pretty weak when I was last here. So, it'll probably be time to kill a bandit or two. Oh, Ember Embish Shard Mine, isn't it? I just dealt with Bowl Gulch Mine, didn't I? Can't even... There you are. Hi there, Mrs. Bandit. Did I now? Because from what I see of this, you're actually quite weak and puny, and I can just kill you. See? Darren, Janessa, I got this one. Alrighty. Now we're going to need to go in here, and... Alright, Woodcutter's Axe. Do I want to take that? Hmm. I'm going to have Janessa take the Woodcutter's Axe too, just in case. That it. No, 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 we're going to need a pickaxe as well, Janessa. Alright. So, charge into Bile Gulch Mine. To start things off, let's trigger their trap. Because I can see Janessa doing that on her own. Really, you want to try and use the trap to knock down the other people, but we don't need to worry too much right now. <laughs> and Janessa just hit the trap. Janessa's fighting against the rocks. You're down. Oh, I missed you. That's alright, though, because Janessa's, yeah, dealing with you now. And I'm missing my shots, but one more into him. Perfect. Archery goes up, and... Oi! You get bashed. Good job, Janessa. That staff's lasting quite a long time with her. So we, so we loot these guys for whatever pitiful supplies they've got. And down here, there'll be a pickaxe. Perfect. And I'm also going to mine the iron in this first bit, because we'll need tons of iron to build our house. So, we've now got a pickaxe in our possession, and this means I'll head back to my new home, which is currently nothing, and just kind of see what I can make so far. Back now at the plot of land, I've just got to wait for Janessa to turn up, then I can get everything from the chest and start building. So, oh, good timing, Janessa. Oh, there's a pickaxe right there. Alright, we may have just done an unnecessary journey. However, getting the Warrior Stone was quite handy. Alright, I'm now ludicrously overcarry capacity, but let's see what I can make. So, I I can't make the wall framing yet because I need nails, but I can make the foundation. 
Sweet. So, oh, look at that. We have just a block of land, and I'm actually going to have to work fairly quick to do this. Okay, let's make a couple of sets of nails. Let's also make a lock, iron fittings, and hinges. Look at that. Smithing's going up as well, and I'm getting quite hungry. Yeah, I'm pretty sure your hunger goes up faster whilst you're overcarry capacity, so what can we make? We can make almost everything. We need more nails. More nails to get the roof on. Okay, more nails. Is it more nails? See if we can get this house built. It would be great to get this house built just to finish things off. And I can make the door as well. Sweet, 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 sweet. I'm not going to worry about the rest of that for now. We have a house. We have a house. Let's put all the crafting supplies away for a second. Oh, look at this. We have an actual house. This is pretty damn cool. We have a house now. I am very, very happy with this. We also have, like, some iron ore to mine and some clay and stuff. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of stuff we're going to need. I'm going to take a quick look inside, see what we need to make a bed, just to get the bare essentials out of the way. Right, very bare bones in here at the moment. Just a chest and a workbench. So, yeah, we got a whole bunch of containers and double bed. So we've got the sawn logs, we'll need a couple of nails, some leather strips, and some straw. Straw's going to be the tricky thing there. I will need to head to Riverwood, probably, or White Run and buy that. But yeah, once we've got that, that will then be a house that we'll have, which is pretty damn cool. And a whole bunch of this stuff I'll actually be able to make. So we can get our house done, probably next episode. Just get the start of that, and then we can work on it in future episodes to make it even bigger and grander and more awesome-y. However, thank you all very much for watching. If you're looking forward to exploring Half-Fire a bit more in survival mode, make sure to give the video a like. I'll probably put a poll in as well on the house-related stuff in future episodes, so keep an eye on the cards in the top right-hand corner. Thank you all very much for watching, though, and goodbye.